I'm Joe Michaels. I'm the Chief Revenue Officer at Haptex. And what you see behind me is our product, the Haptex Gloves DK2. This is the most realistic haptic glove for virtual reality. Uh, it's something you wear if you want to feel the virtual environment around you with realism. We have a combination of tactile feedback and force feedback that really lets you feel virtual objects as if they're real. Uh, and we uh, have two different configurations for this product. You can wear it in a standing position or you can wear it in a backpack, which we have over there. And uh, you can get room scale mobility. And this is perfect for VR training and for virtual design and also for robotics. So it's a product we're really excited about. And AWE is the first time that we're showing it uh, to the XR community. So we're really excited about that. Now, see that post that's sticking out right underneath the Apex there? Yeah, like when you want to see that post, put your index finger on that. Push down. Feels nice and solid. Run your hand down the face of the bar. You, you open up all your fingers, run it down the face. You can feel all the boards, you can feel the uh, uh, spaces between the boards. Oh, pardon. Feel that one <laughs> Just shove me if I get it. Spin it real fast. Give it a good snack. No, no, snack it. And then you go. There you go. Now with the other hand, when you snack it with one hand, with the other hand, hold it facing the windmill, and you will feel the wind that comes off of that. There you go. That was a good snack. Give it a good snack. Did you feel it? Excellent. All right. So we have a cloud on the left and a cloud on the right. One for each hand. Guys, isn't that amazing? Put one hand under the left cloud, one under the right cloud. And you should be able to feel each and every drop on your fingers, on your palms. <laughs> now, if you reach up and grab the cloud, make it angry. Squish it. Do you feel the lightning? It kind of buzzes your hand? Yeah. There's a big rock next to the um, bar, and I've brought up a panel that has two buttons on it. Okay. Hit the one on the left. That will um, grow a wheat field for you right in front of the bar. Now, you can put one hand in the wheat field and one in the sunflower field and feel the difference between the two plants. Yeah, it's this vibe puck, it's cracking weird. But do you feel a difference? Excellent. So go ahead and hit the other button that's on that panel. That's going to bring a little um, tractor out of the barn for you. You can pick that tractor up, and when you pick it up, you'll feel the uh, little motor chugging away. And you can feel the little tires turning. Yeah, I don't know your field for you. Oh, I think I ran out of gas. Just um, thrash it around inside that, um, inside the wheat field. Just move it around like a five-year-old. Move it around. There you go. It drops a hay bale from the sky. Now, if you slide that slider like you did, look forward and you'll see that light that's lit up. Uh, a little Tesla. There you go. Take, the, take that pin that you just had. And I'll take the pin. There you go. Now take and, and actually poke the palm of your other hand with it. Can you poke your palm? Poke your other hand? You see the radio in front of you with the blue switch? Turn that blue switch on. And now you can tune that radio using the knobs. Uh, actually, you can grip the knobs. Actually, use your hands and grip the knob. Okay, open that drawer. And now take out the magnifying glass. And you can look at 
and swipe up and down the face of the bond of the Okay, if you look to your right, you see the green? Look to your right. Okay. Now you see the switch that lit? Turn that switch on. And you can see outside. And now flip the switch that's next to it. And now press that button. If you look to your right, the wheel that you just that you turn, you reach underneath, you'll feel water that's dripping. And that's the end of the demo. You've experienced everything.